This is the technique of meibomian gland expression. It will be done in cases of meibomian gland dysfunction to check the blockage and clogging of glands. Procedure of this meibomian gland expression. After doing warm compression, we should apply local anesthesia and small forceps or small pad will be used to, to squeeze the eyelids. While squeezing, will get thick or thin, clear or cloudy, viscous, cheesy or toothpaste-like secretion. Commonly, mastoda pattern will be used to, to press the lids. This is also used as a therapy for MGD along with intensive pulse light treatment and plethoros string can be done. Before this detailed procedure, we need to know what is MGD, how it is caused and how will be the symptoms and what are the risk factors. Meibovian glands or oil glands located at the rim of the upper and the lower lids. These are responsible for secreting oils. This will help us in tear evaporation. Without this oil glands, tear evaporate easily and it will become dry quickly. This will lead to dry eye syndrome. Causes of this condition Multiple factors can lead to MGD. Main common factor is blockage and clogging of meibomian glands. Risk factor of this condition, meibomian gland dysfunction increases with age. This is also associated with blepharitis. Symptoms of this condition, patient can complain with the dry eye, burning sensation, itchiness, irritation and also it can cause redness, inflammation and irritation to the lids also. MGD if left untreated, this can cause permanent damage to the glands, it can form like a atrophy. In these kind of conditions, meibomian gland expression will be done as a procedure or part of treatment. It will reduce the symptoms and improve the signs of MGD. Meibomian gland expression is the one of the most common procedure for MGD. After this procedure, lubricant will be given to improve the tears quality. For daily updates, subscribe for Icarotam Tata. Bye bye, everyone.